Hello everyone, welcome back for another video. Today we'll be revisiting for the third time another jumpstart deck. And yeah, I really like this format. I really like where we can go with it. So we got Basri, Well Red, and uh, Dinosaurs. We visited Dinosaurs, I really like him. Uh, well Red seems pretty cool, but we see Basri, we gotta go for Basri. And I really love these planes and I really want them, so I'll take it. So Basri works great with minions, we know that. Tree hugging. Ah. Well, I don't know if it's good to be a tree hugger. Feather friends could be really good. Um, I really like this lance, how they sew. Minions should be like the best combo if you think about it. But feather friends also seems kind of okay because it means that we get a lot of uh, maybe flyers, which could be cool. Means we get no mana screws. I'll try feather friends. I'll try mono white with Basri. No classic. So we do have Basri, which is awesome. Uh, we got Ward Battle Fence, Seed Striker, I've never seen this card when I've seen Strikers. Attacks you made up a number of... Oh, oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, uh, Legion Judgment is pretty cool. Dauntless Onsault, up to two other triggers to get... Oh, Celestial Enforcer. Okay, uh, where's Buster's Lieutenant? Stuff like that. We got Buster Chocolate, we got Buster's Lieutenant. We have a plethora of good cards. We've got Angel of Dire Hour. Damn! Okay, this is like a really cool deck. All right, I'm very excited. Let's get into. All right, let's get into the first game. Um, yeah, I'm excited. We still got Nick B. Kind of covering this all in the same day. Inside the permanent phase, the battlefield game for life. Time can attack or book. Okay, okay. So face fetters. It's pretty cool. We have a lot of big stuff. Uh, kind of have this. It's not the worst hand ever. I might actually try to keep it. Let's see how we go on about it. Oh, by the way, if you're enjoying th uh, this type of more chillaxed content, which I played Jumpstart, or just any other content I've made, make sure to leave a like, subscribe for more content, because I really do appreciate the video. And also, pretty much forgot I'm like streaming and recording. Like, I'm streaming right now, and I thought I would record. So, I kind of have the recording set up all uh, ready here, sewing to everyone, which is not bad, but I don't like it when I, uh, of course, uh, do, there we go. I don't like it when I record videos to show my stream stuff, because I don't think they belong there. Alright, cool. So what they're playing, is it Starfish? So Starfish is like the most powerful card ever printed in Magic. Like, look at this. It's a Starfish. Can you be compared to a Starfish God? Alright. It's actually pretty good though. Scry one. Not bad. Not bad at all. Get the word Balments. Pretty cool. Even uh If I get to left for its creature you control with flying. Okay, that can be done come down later. We got Knight of the Tusk, which is pretty cool. Ooh. It's my boy, it's Buster Lieutenant. I really love, really love my, my boy Buster Lieutenant. Now, we're slightly getting mana screwed here. Because we really need to get to 4, 5, 6 mana for sure. It's kind of weird. Get to. So, yeah, I am actually streaming right now as I'm recording this. I never tried this before, but I thought I would since, you know, I think, I think it's pretty efficient. And also, twitch.tv slash sentience there. If you can want to come over, hang out, see me live, and talk to me live while I play Magic. Doesn't happen too often yet because I uh, don't really have a schedule right now because uh, life's pretty shit. But eh, what you gonna do? But yeah, uh, as I'm talking to for this video I am uh, streaming a uh, Timur ultimatum plus five color junk which I'm not gonna say which the uh, which junk it is because I think it's important to keep it a secret because it's a secret combination although I do consider uh, um, I do consider a uh, buster get to be a great draw I also consider mana a great draw but we're actually gonna do this like a zero f uh, one four so now it can stop the Octo Prophet, which I think is pretty good. And I'm just gonna attack with that, gain two life, pretty cool. They start fish it up. Hmm. Okay. I'm 
two third there. Kind of weird. I don't know why I say all this information, dude. I'm going, I'm going crazy. I'm losing my mind. It's so hot. I have the headset on. I'm streaming as well. I'm just like dying from heat exhaustion overall. Ooh, Dragon Loft Idol. There you go. Dragon, dra oh. Oh. Oh, shit. This card's actually pretty cool. It's a Gargoyle Dragon. I like it. This is a very efficient card, by the way. Very efficient card, for sure. So I really want to see Buster's Lieutenant coming down. That's some bullshit right there, man. It's bullshit. Alright, I'm gonna buff Healer's Hulk, I'm gonna give Buster Solidary open and basically kill uh, Dragon Lift Idol with uh, Healer's Hulk and stop Octo Prophet from hitting Bastri. I really want to ult him, because if we ult Bastri, that's a very super big plus for us. Because at the beginning of combat on your turn, create a 1 1 White Soldier token creature, put a plus 1 plus 8 creature in control. So if we ult uh, Bastri, we basically win. Okay. Uh Yeah, that's a thing. Fucking finally. Um We're going to start with uh, the same combo, I think. Now we have to rebuild Bastri. But now with the fourth mana, we finally got Bastri's lieutenant. So we're in a good position here. I like our position. We can finally build up. I'm actually gonna f maybe fade further as the Octo Prophet or the Gargoyle, but they have this like weird thing of dragons and so they're playing dragons and leviathans. So I would be smarter to keep fade flutters for something bigger on six and seven mana, which they are gonna have eventually, for sure. Okay, that's fine. We really just need to get more mana to get more creatures down. Buster Cat is a constant problem for them. They just don't really like his presence. A Planeswalker that can also ult. They really don't like that. Okay. That's good for us. Uh, they didn't scry for some reason. with the thrill of Since they thrilled. But that's kind of weird. Okay. They don't attack. Except they have a buff. Which uh, I'm okay with getting it out of their hand. Okay. Cool. So, I'm gonna definitely just bust his lieutenant here. Get a counter on him. Get warded battlements on a 2 5. So, basically, I'm just going, to, I'm just getting warded battlements as big as possible. Also, got, having bust his lieutenant is a great part of our deal to keep everything a little bit safer in case they have. Some removal. I don't know what that removal might be, but you know. Hey, hey, what's up? What's up? What's up, Fai? So how you doing? Woke up from the nap, and now you're still. And yeah, I'm streaming. I decided to stream a little bit, and I'm also recording a video right now for YouTube for tomorrow, which is like, you know, oh, oh, Hellcat Punisher. That's definitely getting face fed. Faith's fetters. Fetter the fates. Fate fetter. Oh my god, I can't speak. Thank you very much. Alright, we're just gonna bump up our boss lieutenant. I'm gonna attack with this big boy right now. Oh, look at that. 6-6. Six, six. Oh, very nice. And yeah, we're finally looking really good. Got boss almost back to 6. Uh, looks pretty good. Looks pretty good to me. I really love Jumpstart. It's so good. Oh, that's a big chunky Leviathan. Creatures your opponent could just get minus one, minus zero. Look at that. Okay. Look at that uh, top two cards of your library. Put one of them into your hand, the other to your girlfriend. Okay. They're kind of milling themselves, though, but we are almost at ultimate Bastry level. And ultimate Bastry is not to be played with. Oh, what's this? Destroyed target topped creature. Oh, ho, ho. 
that's gonna be erect. Erect. <laughs> Alright, I'm gonna get uh, Gale Super. I'm gonna plus one the Gale Super. I'm gonna attack with Buster's Lieutenant for a little bit of extra damage. We're very close to killing them, but I also want to... I just really want to ult Bastry because I never got to uh, ult Bastry, so I'm just like super happy to be able to do that. And please don't surrender, let me ult Bastry. I'm just so happy. I would love to keep him, but I think my opponent will surrender if I don't ult Bastry. And ulting Bastry is definitely like a very good win condition. Also, like Swift response, killing their wa waker of waves will probably mean they surrender. But I really want to see what else they could have. Sweep away or dead target creature to its owner's hand. If the creature is attacking, you may put the top on. Okay. Uh, sure. That's actually pretty good because they get Hellkite Punisher back. It's actually really good now that I think about it. Oh. Dope. 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 Oh, they've really never gonna attack. They're never gonna attack. Alright, we're ulting Bastry, no matter what here. I end up beats. I'm ulting Bastry. And also, thank you, Faisal. Yes, it is a good multitasking. Oh? Ah, there we go. We got him. We got him. We bam, kablow. Got him. I got him, Chief. Yeah, baby, let's go. We finally minus six him. Hmm, nice. All right, so we we're gonna do Knight of the Tusk. <laughs> oh, oh yes, 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 yes. That's the shit. That is what I like. That's what I live for. I don't care about no hell, kite punisher. Oh, get get these dragon hats look out of my face. Get this out of my face. What you gotta do? Look at my power. Look at these abs. I don't know why I'm saying this. I really want one more mana to get Pegasus Plus, even Goggle Master. This is the worst name I've ever heard in my life. Goggle Master. It's, I'm not gonna even make the joke. Hey. Alright. So we get to do this super awesome play of Avon Gargle Master. <laughs> and everything gets a counter again. Oh my god. <laughs> and everything, even if something dies, Buster's Lieutenant gets, gets some shit back. It's so good. This deck is so good, dude. I love it. Like, oh no, you killed it. I have 34 HP, first of all. Second of all, I get another 2-2 two -two token with Vizilas. This guy get even more buffed by Buster Cat. Oh. Oh, sweet summer child. Oh, sweet summer child. Sweet, sweet summer child. That was awesome, dude. So good. Okay. So good. Uh, this card disappointed me. I, I was recording a... Now, I was trying to record the other game with Angel of Dire Hour, but we just couldn't get the 7 mana going. It's not the best hand. This looks way better. So we can keep it. Go for Healer's Hawk. Go for uh, Cor Concordia Pegasus. By the way, for the chat, um, once we finish uh, one more game, basically with this deck, I'm gonna be going to Team War Ultimatum. Don't you worry, I just want to record a quick jump start. So yeah, I'm sorry. All right, uh, unicorns, pretty good, pretty good. All right, let's get some healing, some damage going. I like it. I'm gonna answer about the. I answered about the overlay before, uh, Ghibli. It's because. Uh, what's this? Wow! That's really strong! Yeah, uh, basically. 
I don't uh, want to... I don't want the overlay to be here when I record my YouTube videos because I think YouTube is a separate space from streaming so I don't want to have the streaming elements uh, on the YouTube so I kind of have the overlay off but when we finish the video I'm gonna be putting it back on but we have swarmed the board we are missing a Bastry we're missing a Bastry's Lieutenant Mana uh, Mesa Unicorn does not bother me because I have Sky Tether for it which is good now they're gonna gain a lot of life Scarecrow, are they really playing uh, archaeology? Ar ar really? They're playing some sort of lifeling archaeology. That's that's pretty interesting. I'll give them that. Oh, these doubles. Oh, that's pretty good. All right. We tether it up. Don't think they have a way to effectively now. Uh, do anything about the tether although I can no longer attack from the uh, from the ground I can still attack from the sky very effectively get them now to 9 8 speed if everything passes and I can next turn potentially kill them I think which is pretty good jousting dummy you dummy you fool, you m dummy. I don't know why I'm so mean to jousting them. It's just always so funny. Alright. We'll get Bastard's Lieutenant to give a little bit of love to the healer's hawk. To Mr. Mihawk. And we take it. Very good. So yeah, that was another Jumpstar video. Mono White. Dual, dual calling Mono White Buster Kid. I've really enjoyed the first game. And if you did, make sure to drop a like. Subscribe for more content. So go to twitch.tv twitch slash sentience layer where I'm streaming right now. And well, I'm streaming while I record this. I don't know if I'm going to stream when this video is out. But yeah, do also leave a follow if you want to support me a little bit extra. And hopefully you're having a fantastic day. I'll see you all in the next one. Take care. Bye-bye.